Ruby Gang. It's your girl Shay back with another video, and y'all already know. If you are new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe, give this video a thumbs up, watch all the way until the end. If you are an OG, y'all already know, give the video a thumbs up, tell a friend and tell a friend and tell a friend, because we're about to get this, we're about to get this thing going. So, today's video, I showed y'all a little bit in my, well, I didn't show you, but in my other video, I showed you I have received the package from Alta Beauty. So today is just going to be an unboxing. Y'all already know I have my my goal of recording every day, so I'm sticking to it. So let's get it. So yes, I got this package from Alta Beauty. Hold on, let me do a thumbnail real quick. Okay, it's probably my thumbnail. That'd be my thumbnail. Okay, so y'all, yes, I got this package from Alta Beauty. And I know what I ordered, but I just wanted to do an unboxing and do a video for y'all so y'all can see me, you know. I know y'all want to see me every day. I know. No, I'm just talking stuff, but I should have cut this box before I came on camera. Oh! This tape is intense. Y'all, so I hate the freaking... I hate the UPS, like, because I live, like, it's a gate. So, but if you try to get into it, sometimes it's open. And every time the UPS come, they always leave a little notice of them coming, but they couldn't get in. And now, excuse me, I'd be home, though. Like, I'm here. They don't even try to get in. And I, I go outside and check after they say they tried to, and the gate is open. Like, y'all, it's irritating. I got this Morphe palette about last night. I'm not gonna open it and show you guys because I'm gonna do, I've got a video coming on that. So you guys can wait on seeing that greatness of that palette. And I also, I've been needing me a BB cream. I've been hearing so much good stuff about it and I just never, I've never tried it. So I've tried this one, this L'Oreal. This had like great reviews. So I wanted to test this out. Dang, you can't even see it. Yeah, there you go. But I think that is gonna be like great. I can't wait to test that out. And I needed another um, finishing powder, so I just got like a little uh, Alta Beauty brand finishing powder. It had good reviews on it, so I'm like, I'll check it out. Y'all know we go to, we go to the cheapest one. Well, I do. I don't know about y'all. And oh my gosh, I cannot wait to use this. Let me see. Is it open? Oh, it smells so it smells so good it's a um this is by not your mother's naturals it's a activated bamboo charcoal and purple moonstone restore and reclaim scalp scrub and i'm like i i need one of these like i need like one of them cl clarifying scrubs that it promotes hair growth and keeps your what is it removes buildup and promotes hair growth so I am so ready to use that. Stay tuned because I got a video coming for that too. I got this brow tint because y'all look at my brows. I have like a little bit on this side. I'm still trying to get to fill in but these are my natural eyebrows. Like natural. I, did, I didn't add any brow tint, brow powder, nothing. Those are my natural brows. All I need is this like my wing over here to fill in. And my eyebrows are perfect. But yeah. I've been like loving. I usually use brow powder. But I've been loving brow tint lately. I don't know why. It just gives you that. I don't know. I sh I'll show y'all how I, how I apply it. Because it just be looking so natural. I love a natural eyebrow. I hate a really dark eyebrow. I hate when my girls. I'm not going to say hate. Everybody is themselves. I do not like when girls have half an eyebrow and then they fill the rest in and it's so dark and it looks like you literally drew it on. I just love natural eyebrows. That's just me though, you know? That's just me. So, what is this one? Oh, this is a, um, a, com a complexion roller ball with tea tree oil. And I'm, I wanna use this to, um, it says it helps to revitalize the complexion. A low in vitamin E helps to calm and soothe the skin. I'm sorry about the background, y'all. I was watching this movie. Have y'all seen? Never mind. 
off subject but yeah this is supposed to be good with clearing your complexion and like even in your skin tone because as y'all can see my skin has come a super 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 long way but we still got some ways to go and as y'all can see just on my cheeks not necessarily this one this one got better that one got much better like if y'all have been watching me for a while like you probably have noticed my skin like wow like at least a year ago you've noticed my skin it wasn't terrible but it was bad and then i just this is the last side the last side i'm trying to clear up i just have dark marks basically like all my pimples are gone i have like those not pimples but like the under skin bumps it's but it's not a pimple like when you have makeup but you got like little bumps on your face but they're not pimples it's like under your skin so i need i need to start doing something that's gonna get like down to the in my pores if y'all have any suggestions please let me know down in my description no down in my comments because i was trying everything and don't get me wrong it has come a long way but i need faster results because i i cannot wait until my skin is clear like 100 percent. y'all not gonna be able to tell me nothing i'm trying to tell you <laughs> what Y'all not gonna be able to tell me nothing. But I do have some um, skincare videos coming soon for like taking off your makeup and stuff like that because that was one thing I really had to learn was the proper way to remove makeup because I think that was probably one of the reasons why my skin was starting to, you know, get irritated and break out and stuff. And I also, I needed another one. I have this Burt's Bees. It's like a lip gloss or whatever. It's not zooming in right now. It's upside down. Yeah, it's in peach. It's in peachy. And I actually need some on, so let's see how it looks. It smells good. It smells really good. Is anything coming out? Damn. Now that didn't do a damn thing. Okay, I need some more to come out. It probably did do something, but I like my lips like shiny. I like them kissable lips. Like when you see me, you be like, oh my God, her lips is beautiful. And like I said, this is in peachy. It don't have to have any color to it. It's just shiny. But yeah. I needed another one. My other one was running out. So that's why I got that. In the end. Am I missing something? Oh, okay, never mind. Because I was definitely about to call all to beauty and cuss them out. I thought I was missing something. Like, I got to spend too much money with y'all for y'all to be forgetting my stuff. Okay, y'all, so I got two more things to show y'all, and then we done. So I wanted to try this Prep and Prime, this like finishing spray by MAC. So I just got like this little, it's like a little, um, what are these called? Travel size. It's a little travel size bottle, because I but I didn't want to buy a full one for $27. I like to try my stuff out first. So, yeah, I just got a little travel size one. I'm sure I'm going to like it, though. So, I should have just bought the $27 one. But, anyways. And I also got a new Maybelline Fit Me. Y'all, for real, for real, this is the, um, which one is this? This is the Dewy and Smooth. I, I usually use the, um, I think it's the Matte and Poreless one. The matte, yeah, I think it's that one. It's the, it's like the blue one. This is purple. The one I use is like blue. So that one is like literally perfect. It, I've never, had, no, yes I have, yes I have. When I had a Mac foundation, it literally matched my skin tone to the T. This is literally the only drug. This is the only drugstore for. <laughs> let me slow down. This is literally the only drugstore foundation that matches my skin tone like perfectly i put this on and it literally looks like my skin i haven't blended my neck or anything like it matches my skin tone perfectly 
not necessarily this dude this the do it in smooth one but the matte and poreless <clears throat> in coconut so i got the dewy and smooth in coconut this is i stand by this if you're looking for a drugstore foundation this right here it, it matches your skin tone perfectly i haven't had a drugstore foundation that does that i usually have to like blend real good and it's just too much so yes i stand by this if you are my complexion coconut is the color we need girl so that's all i got that's everything i got from Alta. I didn't get too much stuff y'all i did end up getting some of the wet line gel i keep hearing good stuff about that so once i take this hairstyle out and i do my curls again i gotta i'm gonna try that out for y'all because i keep hearing about this gel and the literally the only gel i use is eco styler so i'm like you know what let me try it out because it was only a dollar at walmart Cause that's why I was kind of iffy about it. For some reason, in my mind, if it's cheap, it, it won't work for me. I don't know why I think like that, but <laughs> I bought that dollar gel. So I'm going to test that out for y'all. So I guess you can add that onto stuff I got, I guess. Like I said, though, guys, that was all I got. So this is the end of my video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate all you guys who watch my videos. And if you don't watch, you know, just start watching start liking subscribing let me know what you guys want to see if you're new to my channel like i said once again don't forget to subscribe and turn your notifications on so you don't miss any videos i'm gonna keep coming at y'all with them so be ready and i'm gonna see you guys on my next video